Good morning. I have run out of questions to answer for the time being. Hint, hint. So I'm just going to read you a section. I mean, I appreciated the whole book, but one section that I appreciated out of, I'm still, still exploring the work of Robert A. Johnson. This book is co-written with Jerry M. Rule, who is another psychotherapist. And so I'm just going to, just going to read a couple pages. Chapter six, contentment requires being who you are, no more and no less. Another psychological process that undermines contentment in modern life is inflation. Inflation is a distorted sense of who you are. Modern people have a psychological tendency to inflate like a balloon. The slang expression, he is just full of hot air, captures this experience. When inflated, we think and act as if we are more than we really are. We are filled with high expectations, sometimes even arrogance. Anything that interferes with our willful desire feels like a disappointment. Modern life pushes us to inflate. Our progress-oriented, bigger-is-better, consumer-driven society celebrates too muchness. A recent bumper sticker was succinct in expressing this attitude. The one who ends up with the most toys wins. The West has been busy for decades teaching the world how to inflate. In some ways, this has become the essence of being American. It is hard to part with something so ingrained as our power stance. A modern person experiences the treasures of the unconscious and instantly his or her ego structure snatches them up and tries to run off with them. For example, something good happens and we try to possess it or we get arrogant, or we try to exploit it or turn it into a business. The ego thinks, it's mine. How can I bottle it? How can I sell it? How can I take this home? We cling to inflations, even mistaking highs for contentment. But peak experiences are not contentment. What goes up must come down. Anytime we puff ourselves up, whether to gain attention, power, status, monetary re reward, or love, there is a price. Every inflation is followed by a deflation, and then the hot air balloon comes crashing down. A deflation is thinking and acting as if you are less than you really are, a feeling of not enoughness. Deflation is displayed through negativity, withdrawal, pulling back, giving up, even shyness. You feel alienated and lonely. At the bottom of a deflation, nothing in life is enough or worthwhile. Inflations and deflations turn life into a wild ride of too muchness followed by not enoughness. They undermine our capacity for contentment. Contentment can be found only in the middle place, the point where you are neither inflated nor deflated. It requires that you be who you are, no more and no less. This is Contentment, A Way to True Happiness by Robert A. Johnson and Jerry M. Rule. So uh, hopefully next week I will have another question to answer, to riff on. Uh, if you have one yourself, please leave it in the comments below or you can send me a DM. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a good day and a good weekend.